Give him the forecast. Omega level threat detected. Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. The following video contains strong sexual content and is rated M for mature audiences only. Viewer discretion is advised. <sighs> I hope y'all are well. I hope that you're enjoying your weekend, you know, thus far. Um, I'm on my way to the gym. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm trying to gather my thoughts because I'm not really trying to be mean here. I want to be, you know, informative, educational, um, semi-professional with a little bit of ratchetness, you know, for entertainment quality, because I really want this message to seep, hello God, in, I, I want your brain, hello God, to be submerged with the knowledge and the wisdom, bitch, of the Supreme, okay? And again, we find ourselves here yet again. I find myself having this conversation over and over and over and over and over and over and over again. Over the rainbow. <laughs> over. Over. <clears throat> Over, 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 over again. Oh, it's never ending. And the fact that we are about to walk into another year, 2025, you know, my mind, my spirit, and my soul, bitch, <laughs> and my body. <laughs> Girl. We're just, we just have questions. Like, <sighs> bottoms of all walks of life, backgrounds, hello God. It, it, if you are taking conkith, okay? Why is it so hard? to understand the basic, the simple, you know, the, 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 pa the path, <laughs> bitch, of cleanliness, girl. Uh, for the life of me, and you know, there's no excuse, e even for the young cunts out there, right? Again, because you have been flooded your generation on top of generation on top of generation, the new information, hello God, new resources, hello God, new technology, hello God, new information, hello God, new examples, the fact that we live in a time where people are not afraid to have these discussions openly, I'm quite sure there are TED Talks on how to be a professional bottom. And you know what? It doesn't even take a professional bottom to know the art, hello God, the need, hello God, the importance, hello God, of making sure that you are clean from the inside, hello God, as well as the outside, girl. And then we got to make sure the inside, we got to double check. Hello, God. 
just to make sure. And see, another way to secure hello, the thought process of, you, you can tell when you see a bottom, a bottom smiling all day, even when they're drinking their lemon and cucumber water and that's all they've had all day long because they plan to get wrecked. <laughs> Trade their top has made plans for slayage, right? They're smiling because they're confident. Hello, y'all girls be the main ones. Y'all be out hating on the girls in, in the industry. The OF industry, girl. The pawn industry. Hello, gone. Y'all be hating. How they do that? How they do that? Because they they sacrifice. Hell, they got a job to do. And it's going to require... <clears throat> The desire, hello God, the need to please and how you please is by being clean. Oh, can I get an amen in the back? Girl, when I was, when I was growing up, when I was a young cunt, before I was introduced to the ways, because right, I was ghetto, I was ghetto. I was one of those people that I didn't really mix well. I did, I wasn't trying to. If I felt like if I was too gay friendly, I would look gay, right? I didn't fully come out the closet and, or be comfortable in my skin until like a little after eighteen, right? So when I was younger, and I, you know, I didn't really, I didn't know, you know. So I was just only, you know, serving mouth. And you know, <laughs> you're getting a little older, and 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 the dudes want to start playing in the backyard, you know. And you like, child, how do I do this? Girl, I was using Aquafina bottles, Coke bottles, any kind of bottle. Do you know how <laughs> to make sure that cat was smooth? So when my nigga asked for the it's good and wet, and after just one, uh, you won't forget. I'm laid up in the tropics, getting sunburnt, bare ass out with the diamond thong on. <laughs> Girl, shout out to Trina. Girl, I'm telling you, like, even when I was young, starting out, yes, mistakes were made. embarrassing mistakes were made but we learn we grow but I tell you no lie there were probably two times in my life maybe three because I was a drunkard back then honey I was I was a I was drinking back then so some things I may have blacked out but I know for sure two again we'll say maybe three instances when I was young I had and made mistakes, okay? But we learn, we adjust accordingly, hello God. And we haven't done that no more because we are mindful, <laughs> bitch. We are demure, girl. We're cutesy with it, okay? We're not out here painting on the daddies. And again, that's that's way before. Now y'all have all kinds of different methods, you know, pure for men. Girl, just realizing having a, a healthier diet. If you are eating a whole fucking Chipotle bowl with extra everything, girl. You don't need to be on the prowl. You need to be at home watching a movie cuddled up. Apps offline, girl. The only app that needs to be open in your home, where bitch, is Netflix, girl. Hulu, Prime, Max. You need to stay at home. The store is closed. 
There's no reason for you to be, no. You don't need to be on the search for cock. You need diet cock. That's what you need. You need to stay at home and drink some diet cock. You need anti-cock for the night. You're in, girl. Put your little Teletubby onesie on. Cut on your shit. And understanding your body too. It took me a lot. It took it again. Experience can only be gained with experience. Okay. Taking the time to understand your body. Your body is going to be different from everybody else's. You might have a homegirl who can down a whole pizza, and then within the hour she's ready. And there's no residue. There's no paint. There's no. There's no clocking, girl. But you might have a different type of metabolism, a different digestive system, hello God. You might not be able to, your body may not be able to handle all that. You might have to go ahead and just say, girl, I'm finna sit in for the night, girl. We finna eat popcorn and slap five and, have, and drink some wine and watch reruns, girl, of Scandal. I'm just saying though, like it's just, it's just, it's we're. Uh, uh, mm. We are not a young species anymore. This is not a young world that we live in anymore. Um, we see that even the, the the younger gays now are handling business, right? No, they're not. <laughs> I'm just over it, girl. And y'all should be ashamed of yourselves. We sh we're going to start treating you girls like Cersei Lannister, girl. Shame. <laughs> Shame. Am I safe to go? After your atonement. My atonement? comes before you. She has committed the acts of falsehood and fornication. She has confessed her sins and begged for forgiveness. To demonstrate her repentance, she will cast aside all pride, all artifice, and present herself as the gods made her to you, the good people of the city. She comes before you with a solemn heart, shorn of secrets, naked before the eyes of gods and men, to make her walk of atonement. <laughs> I don't get it. And I know, and you know what? I, I have the belief system of, I understand what we're talking about here. We're talking about bow tie, okay? We're talking about the place that releases, you know, all of the foolishness, the toxic trash. You know, I understand what comes out of there. But if you clean it the right way, you won't have to worry about anything coming out of there while you're being pleasured in there. And I want to go back to understanding your body and, and things. You should not be out here eating street Mexican, Mexican street corn, bitch. Hello? If this is your plan. I should not have to, because of your recklessness, because of your failure, hello God, to, to adhere to proper hygiene protocol, 
Okay? Now, I have to bathe in peroxide. Now, I have to double, triple, quadruple scrub my skin. Hello, God. Because y'all know how difficult it is to get that smell off of you, your sheets, and even out of the air. For straight people, you know, I hear all the time. You know, let's tell the truth, girl. There's a, there's a lot of um. I have a lot of homeboys that you know, and a, a lot of, you know, my nephews are grown now. That they tell me, you know, that some of these fish be fishy, and that smell is kind of hard to get rid of. Mm. Girl. I don't know. I just I I just really feel like it's the disrespect for me. It's as if you just and this is my thing too because this is what the excuse was from this person that I'm that's motivated this conversation. And again, this is not me trying to, you know, give myself <laughs> um ego props right this is just real shit it's not my fault that you're so big I didn't anticipate you being so big and I didn't anticipate you to go so deep and to touch my spirit my soul and my everlasting existence I added that part <laughs> I added that part hello god and I looked at this bitch and I was like, when you're out here on the search for America's next top model, right? <laughs> pictures are pictures. The real thing is the real thing, right? And you got to prepare it. You know, the same way the Lord prepares a table before, you know, in the presence of your enemies, girl. I hate when the sun does that bullshit. Like, you never know what that caucus is going to do, what it's going to look like. And I can tell by the way that I was working his ass, right? He didn't expect Oh, he didn't expect. <laughs> Making my way downtown, about to fuck him good. And it's gonna last. Da -da 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 -da. And I slayed you. <laughs> and now you wonder if I could. Oh. <laughs> I'm just saying, though. I can tell he's like, well, I didn't expect that. You never know what to expect, baby. You know, when I was frolicking in the bottom fields of life, I met up with this anime dude. Uh, he was a gamer, whatever, streamer, whatever he was, right? You could tell he was a, he was nerded out. Do you know? I was like, oh, I don't sure. He ain't finna, I'm finna work his soul. No, he worked my soul. On my soul. He worked my soul. <laughs> Like, you don't ever think you you got someone figured out. Don't judge the book by the cover, baby. Because that gamer, that nerd, put me in my place. I had to grow up, too, and realize just because you got print don't actually mean you you working with anything. And just because you got a you you may have a big thing 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 means you may not have you you may not know how to work it. I've been heavily disappointed in my life by judging the book by the cover. You gotta prepare for all eventualities, bitch. In a good bottom, a real bottom, a professional bottom, one that has respect for thine self. And the person that they are about to let wear them out the frame, honey. 
they're going to make sure that they are prepared for all eventualities. Honey, I laid with this Mexican guy when I was frolicking in the bottom fields, right? He wasn't the biggest. I actually was about to say, mm. but when I tell you, I felt that man deep in my soul, on my soul. And like I said, I've laid down with anacondas and they don't know how to do nothing. You know why? That's their ego too for them. They so big, they don't think they got to put in no work. They've never had, they just let, they just, people just lay there and take it because it's so big. But if you don't know how to do the do, hello, that's, that shit going to be below mediocre. We don't do below mediocrity over here, bitch. We excel, honey. Hello, God. We excel at the at the belief and the ideology that sex should be a transcendent, a transcendent experience, girl. And there's nothing more disappointing than having some fine shit, right? Ooh, when I tell you bad baby bad I wasn't even I wasn't even halfway done I would man the thing hmm. I ain't gonna lie I had pop took me a little honey pack <laughs> I was, man. So disappointing. I told him to, like, after the fact, you know, I was like, look here, bro. Like, I wouldn't mind, like, again. But next time, you need to make sure that you're leaving those beef and bean burritos the fuck alone. Like, whatever corn salsa you had... Like and 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 I know y'all be like, oh, pretty privileged because you know he he he's a little a little bad bit, like bad little bitty. You feel me? <laughs> okay. It was good. It was really good until like you know one, I can tell when I'm in that second dimension. Hello. <laughs> I can tell when I'm hitting that second dimension. When I've boldly gone where very few men have gone before because the change in there's a change in sound. Hello, there's a change in movement. There's a certain level of submission that takes place when I know that I have tapped into the next realm. Okay. When I have brought Hello God, the walls of Jericho down. Okay. And usually, I understand that's when a bottom is tested the most when it comes to their cleanliness. That's why y'all need to be making sure that y'all are good, good. And it probably is my fault because, unfortunately, in 2024, going into 2025... I have had some experiences to the point where I've had no choice but to ask this question when we're in the talking stage of, of, of right before we link up, right? To where I have to ask bottoms, are you cleaned out good? That's my exact wording. Are you cleaned out good? Is that boo tying that hole ready? Right? Oh, yeah, I just took a shower. <sighs> I hope so. But that's not what I asked to see. A shower doesn't really tell me anything other than you've cleaned the exterior. What about the interior, bitch? See, y'all y'all think y'all can just take a shower turn on the high level, the concentrated spray of your damn um, showerheads, girl. Hello, God, because everybody has one now. 
You think by putting that up there, that's that's getting you cleaned out. No, baby, you need to go to the store, Pelagon. You need to go to Walgreens, Walmart. You need to get some fleets, honey. So an enema. And you also need to be asking yourself again, what have I eaten in the past couple of hours? If it was that Chipotle bowl with extra everything, you need to say, you know what? Mm -mm. Cause one thing about all that sloppy ass food is it sits on your stomach and it's, it's gonna digest and digest and digest. You don't need to, I don't care if you had one taco today. Today is not your day. Put in for PTO. We'll approve it. <laughs> we will. <laughs> girl, just call me the top HR, girl. HR, human resources for tops. Uh, we will approve your PTO request, girl. We sure will. Take a mental health day, bitch. Save us from your messy, messy ways. Okay. I will. I won't. I won't uh, uh. I don't condone that on any level. I just took a shower. No, you need to. You need to shower on the inside. Take your time. It's, it might take some time. And again, I always have this message: if you're on the apps and you're searching, people be trying to hook up, kind of like within that first ten to fifteen minutes, kind of vibe. Make sure that you're already clean. Make sure you've already done your due diligence. And again, if it's been a minute, a couple hours since, go ahead and do a, do a cute little touch up real quick just to be sure. And again, you should never be sitting out here assuming and thinking you know what that cock is going to be doing. I can tell that when we when we when I went to go pick him up because he lived around the corner from me. I can tell that he wasn't expecting. Oh, I didn't expect all that. I didn't expect to get this, you know, don't judge the book by the cover, baby. I'm telling you. That's all I really got to say at this point, because I'm, I'm, I'm kind of over it. I think that it's it's very uncouth. It's unprofessional. I, it's it's disturbing that this is an issue in today's time. And again, I know we're going to have those people out there saying, well, shit happens when you do things, you know, in the bootay. I get that part. But, honey, my experience has shown me I, I've dealt with people. Hmm, hello, God. Squeaky clean. Like a whole maid service just went up in there and handled it sprayed there's a sparkle to it honey no smell no taste unless you're one of the the, the girls who like to spray a little extra hello guy perfume down there real quick i'm really into the ones you know sometimes i get a starburst and pop it in and i go <laughs> i'm like what yeah i told y'all i'm i'm nasty when i want to be when I'm feeling it in the moment. I can't do that with some of these girls. And I'm so glad I'm not, I don't give everybody the treatment because, uh-uh. Again, I, I guess we, we're gonna call this video, um, just be prepared. <laughs> Please just be prepared at all times. You just never know. If you're out here searching for that, no one wants that. Because you might be good, like, because I'm always looking for someone I can have a regular situation with. And first impressions are everything. And the thing about it is, though, and let's just tell the truth. I know that I might not have been everything to everybody. And, you know, because everybody has their thing on what they'll return to, right? But my track record shows that people actually enjoy returning back to me. But I'm sorry, if I didn't get a good, if you didn't leave a good impression with me, I'm not going to be hitting you back. I'm, I'm, I might keep you at the back of the roster, like, just in case, girl. One of those drunk nights. Okay, hello, God, where no one else is, hit, is hitting the phone. You know, and at the very most, I might just want a little bit of sucky sucky. Because now, in my mind, I'm like, oh, Lord. Like, 
are you going to be, you know, displaying your fucking Picasso artwork this evening? <laughs> I don't want to have to worry about that. I've readjusted. I've had to like delete some people from the roster because girl, there's just so many things I can get into. Like that's probably going to have to be for another video, but there's two people just recently pissed me off and I had to delete them from my roster. So that's why I'm out here feeling out new potential. Um, so far, not good, um, but we'll see. Um, I might just have to do the whole like stay to myself thing for a while, but I don't know. Anyway, y'all, that's all I got. Again, y'all be prepared, honey. Um, cause I'm going to let you know as a top, as a bottom, as a verse, however I'm feeling, I'm going to make sure that I'm, I'm grade A. And you know what, to be honest with you, because I like my, whole oh, <laughs> played with. Even when I'm just, I know that I'm going to be a top that day, I still clean myself out. Just in case, because I'm not going to lie, you run into them bottoms, honey, that don't mind eating a little bit of that. <laughs> they don't mind going, you know what I'm saying? But they're only going to do it if you're clean. And see, while they're serving, hello, God, while they're doing that, trust and believe, especially if you're in a, in a certain type of sitting position, bottoms can smell all of that down there. And if it smells good, because you let's tell the truth, you got some bottoms that kind of test the limits. They kind of like play down there a little bit. They go they go to the gooch area first. They see if you're going to squirm, if you're going to say no. And they like, they like to tease and test, you know. And the only way that they're really going to do that is if they smell nothing but goodness and grace and mercy. Cause let's tell the truth, tops. I, a lot of y'all out here like to get y'all cake eaten too. So we, I, I make sure that I'm well. Cause I don't know what I'm gonna be. You know, I don't know what that night is gonna. And, I'm, and there's been plenty of times I was so grateful that I was prepared. Because the night would go in a different direction, and what it again, be prepared for all eventualities. That's the message. Be blessed and never stressed. Remember that health is truly wealth and hygiene. Hygiene is the key, girl. Not just exterior, but interior as well. Y'all girls take care. Bye.